हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई मुस्कान आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल सो टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट रिएक्ट नेटिव कस्टम वैलिडेशन वाई वैलिडेशन इज रिक्वायर्ड इन रिएक्ट नेटिव फॉर्म वैलिडेशन इन रिएक्ट नेटिव अलाउज एन एरर मैसेज टू बी डिस्प्लेड इफ द यूजर हैज नॉट करेक्टली फिल्ड आउट द फॉर्म लाइक वी कैन सी द लॉग इन फॉर्म इफ वी हैव टू फील्स इन लॉग इन फॉर्म ई मेल एंड पासवर्ड इफ सम वन इज नॉट फिलिंग ई मेल एंड ट्राई टू लॉग इन दैन वी विल रेस्ट्रिक्ट यूजर टू लॉग इन इन द फॉर्म विदाउट विदाउट एंटरिंग ई मेल सो दैट्स हाउ वी रिक्वायर वैलिडेशन इन रिएक्ट नेटिव सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल फोकस ऑन क्रिएटिंग अ वैलिडेटर फंक्शन विद वैलिडेशन रूल You can see example code here, but we will also check with a uh, real time project. So I will use custom validations today. So let's get started. I have already designed this login form as you can see in emulator. So now I'm gonna add validations on email and password. so first i will add validation on email uh, and when i submit this button it should be um, give error if it is a uh, blank field so for this first i will take um, a state for error which should be an object first key value in object uh, is field and second one is message you will see how i will use this error in this component next i am going to uh, add on press button on on submit so i am adding this and now i, I will create on submit function with fat arrow and in in on submit i will create a variable which uh, will be login error Uh, which again hold an object and uh, in this object we have two keys one is field and other one is message so um so now i am going to check for email like if email is blank string which is its initial value like you can see here in state email is blank so if email is blank i will add login error field is email and if field is email then i will add login error message which is email is required so i have added this field and message in login error variable in field and messages but next what i am i will do is i will set this state in this error so that uh, this error will hold the email field and the message for email so i am going to set error with login error now i will use this error below this input box so um i can show email required message if email is blank so now let's add this here if error dot field equals to email which we are checking here if email blank then this field will be email and then we setting here we set it here then we are showing uh, error dot message here so if i will save and i am going to click on submit can you see this error this is checking if email is blank then it should set email is required message so you can see similar message here right so uh, this we did for email now i am going to do for password as well so let's add else condition for password if password is blank then again we will set login field password and login field message password is required and now i am going to add text error dot message below password here 
for password required so yeah i have added a message for password if error field equals to password then this will show the error dot message if i will check for password so first it will uh, always check email if i will add email here like test at the gmail.com and i will click on submit then it will go to the else condition else if condition and this is checking for password so it is showing password is required which we set it in set error and we are showing this error dot message below the password so if i will add password also but error is still there because we are not adding any else condition here so let's add else condition yeah so uh, in else condition i have set it error with blank field and blank messages because uh, we only need to check email and password then we will set it as initial state and then uh, i am showing here alert for login success so let's check this out when i'm clicking on submit you can see login is successful right so yeah like this you can add custom validation and react native for any form if you have more fields like phone number confirm password or or anything so you can add your validation like this so uh, that's it for today we will learn email validation and password validation for uh, email type and for password type uh, we will learn this in next tutorial thanks for watching if you like my work please do like share and subscribe